Here's problem 20. We have let the function g be defined by g of x is equal to 5x plus 2. So that's the function. g of x is defined as 5 times some x value plus 2. 5 times whatever we put in here plus 2. And it says if the square root of g of a divided by 2 is equal to 6, what is a? Now the first thing I'm noticing, I'm thinking, hey, the square root of all this is equal to 6. Well, what if I just come in here and I square both sides? That'll take care of giving me just g of a of 2 has to equal how much? 36. Now I've got the function just as it wants. It says g of whatever you have is equal to 5 times whatever's right here plus 2. So what do you and I have right here? We have a who? a over 2. So I'm just going to replace wherever there's an x in the equation with an a over 2. So I'm going to replace this x right here with an a over 2. Normally, I mean, if I had g of 4, you'd just plug a 4 right there. If I had g of 7, you just plug 7 in and you'd go about it. Big deal. It's a over 2. So I just replace that with a over 2. So here's what I have. I have 5 times the a over 2 plus 2. That's what I get. We know that that function it comes out to equal 36 from what we just said above. Now solving this, I'm going to go ahead and subtract 2, subtract 2. I get, I'm going to go ahead and multiply. That's 5a over 2 is equal to 34. Now how do you get a by itself? Well just multiply by the reciprocal of 5 halves. That way I multiply this side by 2 over 5. The 2 and 2 will cancel. 5 and 5 will all become 1's so will leave a by itself. Since we multiply the left by 2 over 5, i got to multiply this guy by 2 over 5. Remember it's over 1. That gives me 68 on top, 5 on the bottom. So a is equal to 68 over 5. Now let's look at our answers. Hey, look at that, 60 over 5. They didn't reduce it, no big deal. They didn't change it to a mixed number, but we're okay there, 68 fifths. That wasn't too difficult. Hard part is when, as soon as you see this, go ahead and take the square root of both sides to get g of a of 2, a divided by 2, equal to 36, get that by itself, and then realize you got to plug whatever you have for right in here, that gets substituted in wherever there's an x. And that's what we did. We replaced that a of 2 in with that x. So we had 5 times a divided by 2 plus 2. And we knew it came out to equal 36. And then solved the equation.